Hello everyone, today is it's actually early Friday morning, 12, 11 a.m. where I am in Hawaii, but this video is really recorded from uh, Thursday the 7th. I have a couple of charts to show. This is going to be a quick video. Just wanted to show my trades from today. This was just a combination of automated and manual trading here. Basically, entering, entering the trade automated or maybe clicking the buy button and clicking the trail stop button very quickly and not letting anything turn into a loser here. And that was good for a small profit of $165, just using the auto trader money management to, um, you know, basically scalp. And then back to our staple, the Superenko uh, 33 has been an extremely consistent performing chart. Uh, it took a little heat here. Uh, it started trading. This one I set it to start trading at the open of the session and a couple of good trades right off the bat and it hit an equity high of about 600 and then it gave it all back plus a little bit and in the previous video I showed the auto traders ability to absorb um, losers like this there was four losers in a row and it gave back everything but the thing is is the the ability to absorb these losing trades they're pretty small and then come back with the big winner this is a, a 200 tick target so that's a thousand dollars on a single contract um, so it made most of its ba back and then just a little bit to go here this brought it up to 961 and then there was another small trade here and it ended up with fifteen dollars of positive slippage and this was in one of my apex accounts as i was editing the video i just noticed something i was wondering why didn't this take these short trades here because this would have easily hit its goal um, with this run down, it would have had a winner here, and uh, even though there was a loser, this would have been a full target, and it would have hit its goal and avoided all these losers. And I looked over here, and I had inadvertently set this to trade long only. <laughs> so as you can see, uh, it only took longs. It didn't take the shorts, and that was a mistake. But in spite of that, it hit its goal. But it would have hit its goal. Um, it would have taken these two shorts and it would have hit its goal here. So interesting that in spite of a mistake, it still hit its goal trading long only. So that worked out in our favor this time. And this was another uh, Superenko chart, except the uh, profit goal was 500 with a 750 loss limit. And this hit its goal of 500. Uh, several losing trades here. This started trading at, let's see here, it started trading at 958. And so it caught these same losers as the other chart. Well, actually, maybe not the same, because there was five losers here in a row. And it drew down just under $600 on a single contract. And then it had this uh, hit its profit target here, just a solid move here, about as good as it gets, 200 ticks. So it made it back up to 475 and um, there was a small trade right here, and it probably had some slippage. So, um, so it basically hit its goal and had some slippage. So I just want to remind everyone, you're welcome to uh, join our Discord channel. And we have some experienced traders here, like Captain Odie, who posts his charts. And uh, just take a look at this comment about our trade management, what he says. He's a longtime BWT user. Anyway, that's all for this video, a short one. Thanks for watching.